Bilateral quadriceps tendon rupture, a metabolic problem. The quadriceps is a large muscle group that includes the muscles of the front of the thigh. The quadriceps muscles work together to extend the knee. Tear of the quadriceps tendon usually occurs about 2 cm above the proximal pole of the patella. Quadriceps tendon rupture is more common than patellar tendon rupture. The quadriceps tendon rupture is typically more common in older patients and occur more often in males. Rupture of the patellar tendon is usually more common in younger patients. Here is an example of rupture of the patellar tendon. And here is an example of rupture of the quadriceps tendon. Note the position of the patella in each example. The patella is high in patellar tendon rupture and the patella is low in quadriceps tendon rupture. The patella is high in patellar tendon rupture because the intact quadriceps tendon is pulling it up. The patellar position is low in quadriceps tendon rupture because the intact patellar tendon is pulling the patella down distally. Bilateral rupture of the quadriceps tendon is rare. It usually occurs in older patients, may be missed or at least have a delay in the diagnosis may occur due to underlying disease. What are the possible underlying causes? Rheumatoid arthritis, diabetes, gout, hyperthyroidism, renal failure, and steroid use. Patient with a quadriceps tendon rupture will be able to flex the knee but will not be able to extend the knee. Patient is unable to actively extend the knee. The failure to actively extend the knee occurs because the quadriceps tendon is not attached to the patella. Clinical presentation. There will be a palpable defect above the kneecap. Pain and the swelling above the knee. The patient will be unable to walk. X-ray will show that the patella is in a lower position than normal, so there will be inferior displacement of the patella. At the X-ray, you may find loss of quadriceps tendon bulge, and also you can find the flag sign. MRI is the best study which will clearly show the injury. You can see rupture of the quadriceps tendon and an inferior displacement of the patella. The diagnosis of quadriceps tendon rupture is more difficult. That's why if you suspect it, get an MRI. Treatment. Surgery should be done early to allow repair of the tendon. So we drill holes into the patella for placement of sutures. The sutures are inserted through the quadriceps tendon for reattachment to the patella. Then use knee immobilizer for 46 weeks and post surgery the extension function of the knee is usually restored. The physician should be aware that bilateral quadriceps tendon rupture can occur and the patient should be examined for any underlying metabolic disease. Thank you very much. I hope that was helpful.